So for chapter two, assessment two, it asks you to download some files and those the student data files are in a lot of different places. So I'm going to show you how to do that. Um, if you are here at the announcements, the start page, you can go to course materials and then student data files are here. And then I'm going to show you the other place and that's where we're actually going to download them from this time assignments. And here's your student data files. So to download the student data files, I'm looking at the attached files. It's a zip file. I'm going to click on that. And then I'm using Chrome. So what Chrome does is it sends it right down here to the bottom. And I can see that it's loading right there in the bottom of my screen. And now it's there. What I like to do in Chrome is click here and say open or show in folder. Actually, I prefer to show it in folder. And then I can see it. So now I see where it is. It's in my computer in the downloads. And I can take this file and I can put it wherever I want to. I can put it on my desktop. I can just drag it over and put it on my desktop. My desktop is really messy, so I'm not sure I'm going to do that. I can put it in my documents um, if I want to. And I can rename it too. So I'm going to open it so you can see what's inside. Since it's zipped, the inside it looks just like the outside. The outside says student data files zip. This one says student data files um, without the zip because that's what's inside. And you want this chapter two data files. This is what you'll need to show me that you've downloaded and moved to your USB drive. So if you take a look right here, this is my USB drive. Now I've got a, I've got some stuff inside my USB drive. If this were your USB drive, you would have a folder here that says Windows. And then you would take the student data folder and drag it over and drop it into your Windows folder. If you're stuck on this and you need more help, uh, watch the video again. Give me a call or an email so that we can um, help you get it figured out.